let's go back to Brittany to talk some more about our weather. I, the, just you mentioned the possibility of snow flurries. <laughs> Again, you know, I still haven't gotten over last February. I don't want to even hear about snow flurries. Well, I think it'll be safe. We only have one model that's indicating we might get a little bit of light snow, and it's mainly going to be west of 35. It's not going to be impactful if we do see it because we have some very dry air that any of that precipitation is going to have to overcome. Just like today, but we are seeing some light showers mainly south of the metroplex. This is going to continue to shift off to the east over the next couple of hours. So some of you are actually going to get some much needed rainfall around Hillsborough over to Corsicana, Mejia. These are the areas where we might actually get some measurable precipitation up towards Dallas and Fort Worth. It's just going to be a couple of sprinkles, if anything at all. But this is also bringing us the cloud cover throughout the day today. So around Joshua, maybe a few sprinkles, and then we could see some of that headed up towards Mansfield and Waxahachie. Very light rain, but around DFW right now, things are pretty quiet. This precipitation, as I mentioned, continuing to head off to the east. So that evening commute is looking a bit drier along 35, but heading off to the east around Mineola, Tyler, and Pal Palestine might still be dealing with some of that rain later on today and could even see it lingering until about 10 o'clock tonight around Corsicana and Palestine before it moves out of the area. But notice the clouds have stuck with us along I-20 and especially south. The further north you go up towards the Oklahoma border, actually enjoying a pretty sunny day on the way. But as far as those rainfall totals, they're going to be pretty minimal around Terrell and Hillsborough, Corsicana, Palestine. That's where we could get a tenth, maybe a quarter of an inch of rain, which would be great. We definitely need any of that precipitation. But our temperatures are sitting at 53 in Denton and Dallas, 56 in McKinney. Same in Greenville, 57 for Sherman. A little bit cooler, though, around Corsicana, Hillsborough, even the 40s down towards Hamilton and the Stephenville area. But in DFW, we're going to warm up into the lower 60s this afternoon. We'll have a few peaks of sunshine, and it'll still be a pretty nice evening on the way. 52 degrees around 8 p.m. But temperatures will stay a bit cooler southeast of us because you're going to see that cloud cover and some showers. So about 55 this afternoon in Corsicana, 64 in Bridgeport. And we're looking at 66 degrees in Mineral Wells. So where we're seeing the rain, that's where we could get a little bit of fog overnight. Could be dense at times, but it's going to be clearing out towards sunrise because we have our next front moving in. That's going to give us some breezy winds and temperatures a bit cooler tomorrow. We'll be in the mid 50s, but looking ahead to Wednesday, that's when our next disturbance heads our way. And this is the one model that's hinting that we could get a few snowflakes mainly west of 35 and then some light rain around the DFW. But as I mentioned, any of that precipitation is going to be very light, so we're not looking at any impacts from that. And Wednesday is also going to be our coolest day of the week, Karen. Heading into Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, we have 50s and 60s.